How's it going? I hope you're having an absolutely fantastic day. Welcome back to another episode. Welcome back to this session that you've completely missed everything of. So it's only been about 15 minutes. I'll tell you, I'll give you a brief recap. So the point of this was to go into this chasm east of Kakariko village. And the first part of uh, yeah, the recording that <laughs> doesn't exist anymore was uh, finding the chasm, which we found uh, pretty straightforwardly. Um, then the next thing is we found a korok up on top of that hill that needed taking to another hill. So that was a little expedition that we went on. And we also had a tiny little battle. And we looked at the food that we have so far. So we've got all of these dishes that we've heard last session. So basically the goal was now to jump into the chasm. And I did this and then I died. And that's when I figured out that I wasn't recording anymore. So, well, that was <laughs> never <laughs> recording to begin with. So, um, yeah. Now, the thing is, I don't know where the bottom is here. Okay, we can see the uh, little, what were they, pose? Yes, pose. So, I'm quite curious what we're going to find over here and how we find the big tree-like thing that uh oh there it is i think we can spot it there in the distance nice let's just head straight over there then uh do we have bright bloom seeds that is the question that is on everyone's mind of course and we do have a giant one so i want to plant it here you're not gonna believe me but i can't remember how to plant these i thought i just returned here and no oh. How have I forgotten how to do this? Oh, wait, we just had to strike it, right? Okay, okay, okay. I was like, wait, what? Ooh. Listen to I. So annoying, you creatures. Probably worse than the skeletons up there. So where were we going? Ah, yes. Over there. One heart damage to the gloom. But not to worry, because as far as I remember, those things give you the uh, hearts back. What is that? We try to go against it got 90 bows and we still don't know what they're used for 27 arrows i feel like we can get closer how do you do damage oh wait we know that where have you gone you had one task. Uh, it's another one of these. Well, we've practiced enough, right? This no longer is uh, the menace. Look at the damage. Oh, well, I'm... I am holding a piece of rubbish. Oh, this is such a beautiful weapon, but it's still not enough. Do we do we actually do this, or do we just carry on on our journey to uh, activate that plant thing? Plus, we're gonna really, really destroy completely our beautiful weapon here. Yeah, now it looks like we've done about 20%. It's going to take us a while, for sure. I'm just wondering if it's got a second transformation. Because if it does... Where's the ceiling? 
And if it's not ceiling based, what sort of weird situation are we going to get into? No! Let me off! What? That is so unfair! You know what? Let's just skip that marbled goma and uh, go on our business. We can always come back. We can always fight it again. We've already done this. There is a an interesting reward there, but is it worth our time? I feel like at least going here, we're slightly moving towards something. Where's the other one? We've already had that fight before. And now it's just harder for some reason. I don't see any pathway. Wait. Yes, I do. Never mind. Never mind me. I'm just being silly, aren't I? Takaruk Lightroot. Epic. I think we can skip it. Very nice. And my heart? Perfect. Let's uh, go and check out that, whatever that is. No, no. All right, what's this about? Wait. Mmm. Bomb flower. Delicious. Oh no. Wait, didn't this explode or something? Yeah. Jeez. That's a bit crazy. My battery's low. I don't know where to go. Every time that I end up in the depths, I just feel very confused. Where do I go? What do I visit? What do we check out? Come on. Painful. Not use. Let me switch. Well, actually, let's destroy the end of this soldier's claymore and then switch. I, You know what? I don't really want to use that beautiful one. No! Unacceptable. How dare you! Here I was, just going on a Poe collecting adventure, and sugar did not intend to do that. All right, we've got a few more. Ooh, what do we have here? Do let me know in the comments if you know what I should visit down here. If there's anything. Any direction I should set out towards because I feel like I just walk and walk aimlessly down here and uh, yeah, you run into really interesting mobs and whatnot, but I don't know what the intention is other than the part that we already did, right? The uh, big section underground with the fire temple and whatnot. How else do we progress the story down here? Does this even happen? Or is it just a matter of investigating and just carrying on down this path that we're already on and eventually finding interesting stuff? Because it looks very void, void of life, other than a few mobs and... Uh... No, no. They sometimes get in the way, don't they? I think that's uh, one of the problems with the engine that I've seen is you're walking and then bam, suddenly gust of wind. I am in shock. 
How did that not work? Well, that's a bit of pain. With that. With that over there. So we're trying to get over there. I think I'm going to use another one. I wonder if they stay put. What are you? And do I... Yeah, I know what you are, but... Do I dare go up against you? Really interesting. But no. Not really for me right now. Do I actually... It's the second version of the Flux Con... You know what? I don't think I want to. I'm gonna chicken out. You know what? We're already here. I should... I should do this, right? Come on. Where's it gone? No! Wow. Is it gone? Why am I using this? What to do with this? What am I supposed to do? <laughs> but I clicked! Why did that not work? Ah, oh, come on, man! <laughs> Nothing is working for us today. We just wanted to go over there and do a uh, thingy. Maybe this is a sign that we shouldn't be down here. I wanted to activate that thing. We can't get there because there's this massive wall of nothingness. Now we do have a soldier over there. So let's shoot this first. Wow. Oh no. Hmm, see. Scared me. Might be able to get there. Ooh, a very nice soldier's cave. It would be nice to open that uh, so that we can teleport there, right? Can't see anymore, that's the thing. But it's up there, right? We just have to keep in mind that it's somewhere up there. Yeah. That is not an easy thing to climb. Let's try anyway. First phase complete. Now for this one. Hopefully we can make it just around that corner. Well, well, well. No dice. We can't really get up there. Oh, come on. Stop forgetting basic things. It's not that hard, is it? There's gonna be, what should be gloom just above this? Uh, oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Migo O, Lightroot. Very nice. And this finally recovers our issues. Uh, with our gloomy hearts. Very nice.
I am happy that we made it because this is a bit of progress at least. And um, let's see. Yeah, we're we're uh, slowly, very very slowly, chipping away at at this whole situation. It is vast. The depths, vast, super vast. Okay, okay. So I think. We should go back to the surface and start making our way to Zora's domain, unless anyone has uh, is opposed to the idea. Say so now. Three, two, one. No. Okay. Let's head back up to Timowak Shrine. And where was Zora's domain? I feel like it was somewhere here-ish. I don't know. Here, wasn't it? Yeah. New adventure. I'm really, really looking forward to uh, this side of things before heading to the uh, southwest, just because I really love Zora's Domain. I have, I have, I love the uh, concept. I love the art, the visuals, the um, the soundtrack, everything. It's like Water World done right. It's not swimming and stuff like in a bunch of other games. It is. It feels like you're on a in a mystical place. Essentially, is what I'm trying to convey. So north, northeast. And I remember this place. We struggled a bit. Well, maybe struggle is too harsh of a word, but... There were moments where I doubted myself. Let's head towards the, those lights, essentially. I don't really know if these constructs are going to be a massive threat to us or not. I'm going to need your help. You're not going to work here, right? I need food. Wow, that was painful. Get out of my face. One shot! Come on! Alright, different strat. We bomb our ways in. Our ways? Our way. It is too warm. I can't speak. We do have fun. No. Wow, it hit me. You can burn people, right? I, I need I need more food. That's a lot of damage. Okay, can we just switch to an actual weapon? Oh! Just get wrecked already, alright? Just go. Beam Dead already. Number one. Do we care about this bow? Yes, we do. Number two. What's in the chest? Something special. Epic. Number three. Where's the northeast? Over there. Okay. There's the lights. That's our goal. There's a lot of enemies. This is not an easy area to traverse. Especially not when it's raining. Talking about raining. Very nice. There's a rabbit over there. It's going to drop us some delicious rupees. Pretty few though. That. So 
people. Oh my god. The first tower. The first tower. It makes me really excited to see that. Beautiful. Let's carry on. I remember it wasn't as easy to get there. It took a while. There was this whole quest that you had to do. Um, the other one, you had to follow something. Yeah, was it following those blue things? And there were two ways to get there, essentially, as far as I remember. This is the way. So there's this purple stuff, which is like malice, but it's not at the same time. It's like tar. It's so weird. Where do I go? You heading over there? What's the deal here? No, come on. I'm, I'm pressing buttons. It's not working. Because I've got the switch connected to a capture card. And I think I've got about 200 milliseconds of latency, which might not seem like a massive amount, but but it makes a difference. Plus the controller latency as well. So where am I going? I guess we're following that route. Are you for real? So annoying. Okay, there's one bridge. And then there's the big bridge over there. And I think we are supposed to take this path. Don't touch the pram. Are you excited for this? I really am. I'm happy we made this decision to leave the uh, the depths for another day because because this place is just magical. And here we are on the bridge, and we can't get onto the bridge because purple, horrible. Rubbish. No way. Wow. I'm thinking of just jumping. And then I should be able to get another boost. No? Oh no. Maybe this was a bad idea. Please, please, please. Oh, this is not good. Oh, this is such a bad idea that I made. That I had, sorry. Barely, we might just make it here. But the question is, can we make it up the whole thing? And immediately into the purple rubbish. Ooh, would you like help with that sign? Hello, Addison. It's been a while. I'm sorry. I don't know if that will be enough. Will this be enough? Nope. Unforgivable! Aha. Alright, will this be enough? Oh, come on! I don't have time for this. Oh, 
This purple, horrible stuff. Extremely annoying. Down here. I'm just gonna put it on this side, right? Just do it. Let's see what happens. I need to do something proper. I see, I know, but... <sighs> I didn't want to waste all that time, you know? More thought out. So my thought process goes like this. To the edge over here, to the edge over here. And this one goes like this. There's no way that falls over. Now this is it. We've done it, right? <sighs> You're always so shocked. Delicious food? Question mark. Rice balls, was it? Ooh, red ruby. And some rice balls. And the metal bud. Good luck, Addison. I'll see you sometime in the future. And now, let's finally complete what we came here for. Just, just, no. Just, just don't. I'm not interested. There's the bridge. There's the main bridge. It takes us into Zara's Domain. All this rubbish on the floor. I'm guessing that's our next main task. Somehow we have to figure out how to how to clean all this rubbish. I think now that we're here, you can see it falling down from the skies and you can see the water is pretty dirty. Something is yeeting all of this rubbish at us. And we can see it there coming from the sky. So our task is gonna go be to go to the sky. Other than that, I'm slightly curious about checking out that shrine. But not before having a chat with someone around here. Oh, hello. Sidon, was it? Uh. Mm. Uh. Mm -hmm. Sludge. Mistaking you for someone else. Unacceptable. The precious statue. <laughs> Lenny. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Be gone, sludge. I do not want to stay. That's too much money for a bed. All the music. It's of mystery. It's of what has happened. And with that said, I think it is time to end our episode here for today. This has been an epic voyage so far. I am so curious to check out what else is going on in the domain to have a chat with, I think it was Sidon and uh, yeah, the other people, the main people in charge of this uh, location. Other than that, I think we have that shrine to also go for and then probably time to head for the Sky Islands for whatever challenge we're expected to encounter over here. Do let me know your thoughts on the underground, if I should carry on exploring or if I should just kind of treat it a bit like a curiosity basically checking it out every now and then to see what's going on and then heading back to the surface uncovering it bit by bit but not really dedicating three or four episodes just solely to exploring so let me know what you think about that anyway i hope you enjoyed this little episode and hope you have an absolutely fantastic rest of your day and i'll catch you in the next one